All right. <laughs> AC is going on and everything. Well, hello then. Welcome back to another Pokemon Masters video. <clears throat> you might be wondering if you've been keeping track of the Pokemon Masters videos. I used to do some Legendary Gauntlet videos, but f for like the last few, I haven't done any videos. Um, and like, what's the deal with that? So, Legendary Gauntlet, it's just yeah. There's two reasons why I don't <clears throat> I don't do a lot of Legendary Gauntlet videos. One is I'm not very good at Legendary Gauntlet. Honestly, you have to have like a lot of units. You have to have a lot of units upgraded, and also you have to be pretty good at the game. Um, this is completely different from Champion Stadium because Champion Stadium you can like do the same thing over and over again, but Legendary Gauntlet actually requires like a lot of planning, a lot of skill, and um, really good like sequencing and game knowledge and um, predicting the the enemy's moves. Um, so yeah, that's why I never I never really do a lot of Legendary Gauntlet. Like my ranking last. Last ranking was I was like I only had 12 wins, so I wasn't even ranked. And like um, you know we see here that this person has like the first place has like 158 wins. And if we go and look at their like they're just soloing all this stuff like that's crazy, right? Like I can't do this. I have no idea how people can do this. Um, so it was like super impressive, like super impressive. And like they use Eggmons, and like that's kind of how it sh should be, you know really skilled people like that but um again i'm not that skilled um but the other reason which is a pretty big reason is because you know i could probably get you know i think i could get decently far with the amount of units i have i don't think i can hit like 100 but i think i can hit like you know maybe like 48 50 if i'm really good i think i can hit 50. um uh, but again the second reason is like i don't really have that much time <laughs> and energy and like desire to do this Champion Stadium is super easy. It's like I come in and out. Like the last video I just uploaded was like 20 minutes. Super easy to record. Super easy to edit and everything. Um, but when it comes to these videos, there's a little bit more editing involved, um, and and again a lot more planning and stuff. But anyways, as you see here, I haven't even started yet, and um, I only have like a day left. <laughs> so I, I kind of just want to record this video. This as like kind of a fun video. Um, like me doing Legendary Gauntlet to show you guys how much I suck at Legendary Gauntlet because I actually am pretty bad at Legendary Gauntlet. Um, and the guaranteed lucky cookie this time around is Vigilance. So like I can't skip it. And um, you know, the rewards are so good. Like, and people farm them for deluxe cookies because after every win you get more deluxe cookies and then apparently you can restart and get more cookies. Um, but also like the move coins are super important um so all that all that jazz um so yeah let's just get into it and um let's just see what we got again i could probably try to copy people and what they do i can't copy their strategies but i can at least copy their like what units they use so i see this person use sycamore so probably i can clear that with sycamore um and stuff like that but anyways anyways um I don't even know what these guys do. I know Moltres, in my opinion, is the hardest legendary um, to fight against because it requires weather. And so like, it's just super hard because like, um, usually you only have like one weather setter. Um, but yeah, let's just do battle tips. Again, this is just gonna be like a raw recording of all this stuff. Um, Tapu Bulu used grass impact, so grassy terrain. Um, a good way of dealing with grassy terrain is interference, such as um, that conditions that changes. Um, all right, so we weaken resistance. We weaken the resistance when we inflict stats condition or something like that. Um, and we want the ones that last forever, like confusion or poison or burn. Um, all right, let's see. Um. Let's uh, let's let's make a new team, I guess. Yeah, I uh, again just gonna have to be planning it all out and stuff. But let's see if I can do this with just um with just uh, Celebi here. Wouldn't that be cool if I can do this with just Celebi? So we're just gonna use Signet Suit Lyra and Celebi here. Um, do I want filler units? That's the question. You know, do we want filler units? Because if we use filler units, we probably want like Johto units to make me raise my attack, you know, increase the master skill. 
Um, but also like some supporting of uh, attack and stuff is good too. Let's see here. Hmm. These guys. Oh, I can... Well, he's not that good. Maybe I can use Bugsy as one slot. Together. And then I can use... um. I don't know. What else? What else? What else can I use? Again, I'm not tryharding it too hard where I'm like trying to use as least units, amount of units possible. Let's use the other Bugsy. Alright. So a little bit of tactics. We want this Bugsy to be hit first and then that Bugsy second. Um, that's pretty good. Oh, let's name our team. Let's name our team. <laughs> uh, scuffed. LG. LG stands for Legendary Gauntlet. Alright, let's do this. First battle. Um, I'm pretty sure they, they already set up their own grassy terrain. And so all I need to do is um start uh, grass scaling, you know. Uh, but let's do this, let's do that. I don't even know what I just used, but... All right, doing that pretty good. Twin needle, X attack. All right, let's start the um. Let's start it. Something like this. All right. Probably gonna sync with um. Honestly, I might even sync with the Mega B drill. Wouldn't that be cool? Just get a Mega B drill up and running. Always want to do that. Oops. Oh wait, no, I flinched. Okay, we're good. You always want to be flinching. Like you always want to make sure your your Celebi is using moves. Um. I guess we'll let these animations play out. Again, I'm kind of on a time crunch because I only have like one, one minute left. <laughs> or I only have like a day left. Um, but okay. Oh, we also have Leer too. We can load our defense. That's super good. Alright. It looks like... um, It looks like uh, no grass train. So like it's a lot less damage and also a lot less... Um, or I'm using a lot more move gauges here. But... Alright. Ah, uh, sure, let's sync with with them. Um, the reason why you don't want to sync with Celebi here is because you want to keep on flinching, you know? You don't want to you don't wanna lose that flinch. So we're going to attack with that. That did not crit. Oh, I actually have another crit here. Good. Alright. We just keep this going. Oh, also, I totally forgot. Celebi lowers the opponent's stats. So, like, they have such a lower stat right now. Um, which is cool. Looks like they are going to get a Seed Bomb off. Alright, their defense is fully lowered here. So that's good. Um, we're going to sync with the B Drill again, I suppose. Oh, why am I using Weir? I should be using the other move. That doesn't really matter. Um, we're going to skip this because we've already seen that. Alright, good damage. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do all 12 battles in this video or just do the first battle. Or just do the first six, because I don't want this video being too long. But if it goes relatively fast, I can go ahead and keep pushing. Keep pushing, that would be good. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna. I'll keep using Leer, but Leer only costs one, so no harm, no fa no harm, no foul. Um, but it looks like they can't get flinched anymore. Uh oh, wait a minute, hold up, hold up, wait a minute. This is bad. Um, they can't get flinched right now. Uh, that's bad. Uh oh, brutal swing. Is that gonna kill me? Is that gonna kill my Celebi? Oh, confused came in clutch. GG. All right, first battle done. Um, again, you probably could do this solo Celebi. Maybe I'm not sure actually because um, they were able to fight through the flinch. Um, nice. Latios is second. So let's see what Latios is all about. Um, I think is I have to use both physical and special moves if I'm not mistaken um okay we want to lower its stats lower attacking okay easy lowering stats is easy so what we do is um there's two units I can think of that are good at lowering stats um and one of them oh actually Selby is one of them but um Serena is going to be super good here so we're going to use Serena um to lower stats and then maybe we want to use some Kalos again just to benefit off her master skill hmm I'm gonna save Sycamore just in case save Sycamore for rainy day you know what I'm saying um, so with her with uh, Serena I wonder what else I can use with her maybe we'll go back on Kalos wait hold up that's what I'm saying. I, don't, I think the video might be a bit long, so we can go back and Kalos, see what we got here. 
Um, do we have any good tanks that aren't Sycamore? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. He's a good tank, right? Yeah, Eureka is not bad. Uh hmm. I'm gonna try to give him a try. Because Serena is gonna be popping off, so. Uh, maybe I should have a healer at my last unit. Don't wanna be greedy about this, you know, have a healer uh, at the end here. Oops, not, not what I wanna do. Because there's only 12 battles, so technically you only need like 12 healers. So. We can, uh, we can, we can go for a healer here. Um. Oh, we also want a unit to raise Serena's stats. Because she isn't able to, by herself, completely raise her special attack. Um, Glacia. Is that her name? That's not her name, is it? No, that's her name, Glacia. I think Glacia can raise, um, can raise attack. Um. Raise special attack. Also does a little bit of healing. Alright, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's just jump into it. Wait, is this Water Serena? I'm pretty sure it's Water Serena. Um, because I have different sync grids for Water and Dark, right? Um, but yeah. So this is going to be not bad. Let me do this, this, this. Ra fully raise a special attack, which is good. Um, and then we just hit them with the Water Shuriken here. Uh, my question is, should I focus on the side mons? Like the... Uh, the guys on the side, you can do it. maybe. Oh, I have Screech too, which is good. <laughs> um, hmm. I'm just gonna sink with Serena here. Screech is good. Um, I think I should focus on the side mods, huh? That's the bad thing about using a tech unit is because I'm not just gonna kill the side mod free. So we should focus on. Oops, I should have used quick attack. For the uh, for the rebuff, right. Okay, that's not bad. I could use the uh, brutal swing here, but I think uh, I shouldn't get fancy with it, you know, just just do whatever. Um, but this seems good. Oh, X regional. What? I'm 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 a dum dum. I should be using X regional so that my um, my guys heal. I mean, that was the whole point I bought her so that she can heal. <laughs> All right, we're gonna sink on. Uh, we're gonna sink on uh, the Latios here. Let's just skip the moves. No one, no one really cares about that animation here. Um. Oh, actually, Washer again. We'll, we'll defeat it here. So let's do that. Keep on lowering that defense. Let's use quick attack here if we can fit it in. No, we couldn't fit it in. All right, I probably shouldn't use Shriek anymore, but I'm just kind of. Muscle memory is just doing it, doing his thing. Um, okay, we can actually sink again here, which is nice. So we're gonna sink here, and then we're gonna use um. Yep, just more stuff. Oop. Oh my gosh, I got flinched, but that's fine because I should should remove flinch after sink move. Sekarino. Okay, let's just kill the body here. I think it should be fine. Earthquake. Uh oh. Whoa, I did a lot of damage. Rock slide on the flygon? Okay, maybe I should try to target the flygon here. Am I gonna die? No, not quite. Pretty darn close to it. Let's use just use water shark in here. Um Yeah. Mag Magnetron should still be chilling here. Alright, we're gonna sink move. I think the sink move should clear it here. Oh, I gotta freeze. That's Wait, is that good or bad? Because this rock slide gonna kill me or not? Is that a rock slide kills my genuine? Okay, we're good. It didn't land a crit. Alright, this should be it. I mean, there's no way you can survive that, right? Yep, no way. Alright, gonna hit me with a rock slide. I might actually lose Greninja here. Hopefully not. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. See, I'm not good at champions. I'm not good at Legend of Gauntlet because yes, I almost died there. Um, all right. Well, we did that. You know, Moltres. I'm pretty sure Moltres is all about the weather. Like, you want to set weather so that Moltres doesn't like um, is is debuffed. So weather has been activated. Any weather will remain during the whole time. But um, Moltres will always set. Um, Sunny day, 
which will increase power of fire type moves, see? So you want to change it with like rain and sandstorm. But then it, Moltres will always change it back to sunny day. And so there's a few strategies I have for this. And, and another thing about sunny day is that it uses fire, uh, the Moltres will use fire type moves. And when you're using fire type moves, there's a chance of burning. So there's a risk of burning. Um, but here's a, one of the things that we can do is use um use uh, Rayquaza here. Because so Rayquaza has a weather wipe. So here I have... N <laughs> I literally have a sync grid called No Sun. <laughs> we have weather wipe here. So we're going to use him and wipe the weather. Um, obviously, if uh, unlucky sequencing, like they cause the weather and then they get a move in, that's really bad. Um, but yeah. Alright, so we have Rayquaza. So we have support. Let's let's check our support units here that we can use with Rayquaza. Um, any Hoenn guys besides Phoebe? Because Phoebe isn't really good. Hmm. Let's expand our options to five stars that I have. Hmm. I'm looking. What can we use here? Because uh, I'm not going to be doing that much damage. So I do definitely need like a healer or two. Hmm, we'll do Eevee. Eevee might be a good healer. Oh, I should probably also sink. I should totally raise um, Eevee to a 6 star, right? Honestly, let's do that right now. I've never... I should have always been doing this, or I should have done this a while ago, but like... Definitely, um... A worthy unit to 6 star. I, I don't use Leaf that often. Um, because I just think I have better... I have better support units. Yeah, I'd rather be using. Um, here we go. Alrighty. So yeah, we're gonna be syncing with her most of the time, I think. Um, I actually don't like her EX, so we're just gonna leave her be. Her normal design. Um, she has flinching too. I have BV, BV good. Um, I want the. BV one, I guess, because of tackle. And the last unit doesn't really matter. I mean, we can use a. Um, why not? Let's use a. Uh, I think Zinnia's fine. Because Zinnia flinches. <laughs> so we have double flinching. We can uh, disrupt the weather. I think that's pretty decent here. Let's just go for it. Um, yeah. Steven. Can't exactly fully buff himself, but that's why we have Eevee. That's why we have the Eevee. All right. Leer. All right, good. I was afraid that they were gonna use AM. Oh, and I have Status Shield. Oh, I totally forgot. Rayquaza has Status Shield. Or not Rayquaza. Salmon has Status Shield, which is super good because like um, I can uh, I can deflect the uh, the burn. Oh, I didn't even. I, it was all in the plan, guys. It was all in. That was. I was all planned out. All right. Now, how much attack buff am I gonna get from Eevee's uh, sync move here? I actually don't know. All right. How how much how much buff do I actually get from this? Because does the buff scale off her level? No, it doesn't scale off her level. Okay. So it's fine, I guess. I'm noticing that my speed isn't that high. Like I want a little bit more speed, but I definitely need to sink a lot more here. And I'm noticing I'm not flinching. I'm not flinching. Is can Moltres be flinched? Hmm. Also, does Moltres have Solarize here? No, they don't. All right, that's good. Um. Oh, they just got flinched, so they can't get flinched. I've just been unlucky. Um, I think I'm looking good. Don't need to use potion just yet. Hurry up. Okay. Yeah, my stats are are being raised pretty nicely here. I think my speed is good enough that I can like always be using Dragon Ascent and Dragon Rush because it costs a lot to use both of them. My Zinnia doesn't have extra crit here, which kind of sucks. Okay, okay, good, perfect. Dragon Rush defeats it, and so now um Dragon Ascent can remove the weather. Perfect, and I dodged a heat wave. Nice. 
All right, very good. All right, I, at least I dodged the heat wave burn. Um. Okay, yeah, I didn't get burned there. If I got burned, I would have been like a reset. <laughs> Maybe not a reset because I have potions, but it would have been very bad. Um. So yeah, I'm probably gonna also. Uh, I'm just seeing how this is going. I'm probably gonna make this video two parts. Um, the first six battles, and then six more battles. Um, let me potion here. Just be safe. Fire blast. Okay, dragon ascent was triggered, which is good. Which means I was able to uh, remove the weather. I might even be able to defeat the mulch. Yeah, mulch is down. Okay, perfect. Now it sets the weather, and I have to use dragon ascent. Let's use our status shield right now so that we don't um we don't run the chance of getting burned. Because again, getting burned is like the worst thing that can happen right now. Um, I think we got this though. I think that's GG for this battle. Um, again, the double flinch is really good here. Um, Moltres is, in my, again, it's the hardest one. So I definitely want to go all out when it comes to Moltres. Flare Blitz will, um, will hurt, but that's fine. Oh, that wasn't even that bad. Oh, but they have healing. So yeah, definitely want to remove that weather. Um, yep, I think that's that's it. That's GG right there. All right, so the next one is Tapu Bulu again. And I want to inflict, um, I want to inflict status conditions, right? And what's he weak to? Is he weak to, um, I think it's flying, which I just used, and poison. Do we want to inflict poison? Does it get... I guess poison resistance because I'll think about maybe using um maybe using like uh, Emma you know what I'm saying like like use some Emma hmm I wonder do they get like less you know what I mean right like lessen their okay I think it's fine so we want to do something with Poison, right? Something with poison or flinching or, or all that stuff. Um, or confusion. Mm. Oh, and also his weakness is, is flying and poison, right? Flying and poison. So we can, we might be able to get away with using poison here. Poison, flying. All right, so... I don't have any other good dragon or flying types besides Steven, which I literally just used. So I think we might just go with yeah. Let's try to try to do Emma here. Do we need someone to consistently poison. Um, let's see. I have a few ideas. Um, yeah. So like we know um. Lucy is super good because she can poison and do trap, which makes it uh, really good against Abu Rulu. James also does poison pretty consistently. Um, but yeah, I think uh, let's do James here. Let's do James because uh, Emma is really strong. Um, another good unit that poisons is um is Leaf, Signet Suit Leaf. But Signal Suit Leaf is, has potions as well, so I think we might reserve her for like another battle. Alright, let's see. Um, we can use... What other healers do I have? I don't want to use those healers. What other healers do we got? Um, so, can she fully raise her special attack? No, she can't fully raise her attack. So maybe we want like a healer that can... Also raise attack. Um, hop, hop seems pretty decent. Um, hmm. Hop is pretty decent. Go with him. Sure. All right, let's try these guys. Um. I don't know. Hopefully this is good enough. <laughs> yeah, let's see. And Hop is pretty cheap and James also pretty cheap moves, so... Alright, so we're gonna try to poison first and then do all this. Oh wait, I'm weak? 
They both have weakness. Oh, I did not use the right move. Oops. <laughs> I did not use the right move on James. They're both weak to something. I'm not sure what to be weak to. Alright, who do I want to sync with? I guess I have to sync with Emma, right? For, for damage. Alright. Sludge. What are the, these moves? Oh, I use Prepare to Fighting, which is self heal. Oops, that's bad. My bad. I should have saved that for later on in the battle. Um. Alright, some damage. Oh, wait, no, Emma potions too. Oh, I totally forgot Emma heal too. Alright, we can be using some Behemoth Bashes here for extra damage. Um. Yeah, pretty good damage. Are they gonna heal themselves from poison? No. Okay, poison lingers. They're just good. Oh, that behemoth back did like no damage. <laughs> Alright, we don't care about seeing the same move there. Looks like Emma's like super low health already. I don't know, I thought her defense might be a bit higher than that. Okay. We're gonna need to potion her up. Alright, hopefully we can sink. I wanna sink um Okay, well, no, we have to cross poison here. I don't want to uh, use sync. Oh, oh, wait, no. I was gonna say fair. I'm not weak to fairy because I'm poisoned. All right, let's try to bring a sync move here. Oh, but they lost their um their poison. Okay, let's try poisoning before we sync here. Um, this might be a lot of damage, so I'm just going to potion. All right, we, we inflict poison, which is good. Doesn't look like they get poison resistant after every poison, so. That, this should be a one shot by the way, almost a one shot, not really, but it was a lot of damage, but it's good. Um, looks like they are no longer poisoned, just not good. Um, but it doesn't look like they're doing that much damage, which is good. Alright, perfect. Now let's see, uh, yeah, we're gonna need to poison them again after this, another poison. And hopefully I can use the sync move here in time. And hopefully poison connects. Wood hammer, yeah, I'm gonna need to heal. Oh, yep, I definitely need to heal. Wood hammer does a lot of damage, I remember that. From my previous encounters with this dude. Alright, let's skip this. Alright, that's not gonna kill it because it was a weakness, right? But, um, alright, we got a potion refresh, which is nice. We might need a poison gas again. I don't know if it heals his poison after this um gets less than half health. Nope, poison remains. We're good. Um, that should be that should be GG's though. That should be GG's. Yep. All right. Next one is Lottie Lottie Lottieos, where I need to lower um need to lower their stats. So a really good unit to lower their stats is going to be um. Champion Iris. Champion Iris is a really good unit to lower stat. Um, trying to think of what other units I have that lower stats. Oh, I guess Keldeo. I guess Keldeo is another good unit to lower stat, but it doesn't lower attack, um, which is bad. Alright, so we have Iris. We have Champion Iris here. Who do you want to use for the Iris? Um, hmm. Screw it. Did we just do my Champion Stadium Marnie team? Okay, no, we should actually use a dragon type here. Um, maybe they don't need to be the strongest dragon type. Like Zinnia? Normal Zinnia? Normal, um... Hmm. I mean, I, I'm pretty, like, Iris is good enough. Like, you don't need more than Iris. But something that can lower defense or special defense would be nice. Because um, Iris doesn't lower defense or special defense herself. So... Or maybe that doesn't really matter. Maybe we don't need that. Alright, let's try, uh... Maybe even... Hmm. I have a lot of options here. Well, we can go ahead and try, uh... We can try Zinnia for now. We don't have a healer again, so... I guess I could use a little excitement. We only have, um... What's it? Eight more battles left? So... Eight more healers. So Annabelle can be one. Cynthia can be one. Uh... Skyla can be one, right? Um, Sonya can be one. Uh, have a few more. So yeah, a lot of healers here. We can go ahead and try to use them. Um, um, 
We can use a... Uh... Hmm. Oh, we have more healers here too, of course. I want to use someone who can raise attack. Attack? Because Zinnia, I'm gonna be using a lot of outrages. I'm gonna be using a lot of outrages, and I'm gonna sync with her once. So that she megas. Uh, but then the rest of the sinks, I think I'm gonna use Iris. Um, so I know Bugsy. Let's I know Bugsy. Not Bugsy. Aaron can raise attack and crit, which is good for Zinnia because Zinnia can't fully raise her crit. Um, and then, of course, we have uh, the heal order. So, yeah, this should be good. Um, do I need any special presets on her? Or no, I only have one preset. Alright. Seems good, seems good. Um, I am going to use. Well, we'll start with. Let's we'll start with. Of this. Outrage, this, and then Snarl. Ooh. Actually, I just thought about this. I might have sync gauge problems here. I might, yeah, my sync gauge might be lowering. Or my sync gauge might not be enough here. Which is, in, which is really bad. Um, unfortunately, I couldn't fully raise. I couldn't fully raise uh, Xenia's crit right here. It's really bad. Um. Yeah, I might ha I might actually run into sync uh, sync uh, sync gauge problems here. Hmm. All right, but we should definitely try to target the side the side guys here. Um, I should target Flygon here. Yeah, I want to lower kind of both their attack and. Special attack about the same here. All right, decent damage, decent damage with Zinnia. Maybe Zinnia was a bad unit. Maybe I should have used someone a bit stronger. All right, we're, we're, we are lowering their um, we're lowering their crit by quite a bit here. So, all right, next sync move we are going to be using. Wait, wait, wait. Flygon's not dead. Mud slap is not good because I think it hits everybody. Then we all get slapped with that mud. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's fine. I can just uh, sync with uh, Zinnia. For some reason, it doesn't look like I have a... Um, doesn't look like I have a... Uh, sync... Move gauge problem, which I thought I would. Alright, well, we'll sync again with Zinnia. And then we'll just keep on using that outrage here. Pretty good damage right there. Telekinesis, not really gonna do much. Um... One more snarl, and then we can start with the dragon rushes. With uh, with um, Iris here. Hmm. All right. Fully lowered attack stats and stuff. All right. This should be it. Yeah. Should be good here. Let's see what stats I need to lower. I need to lower their attack. Okay, so we can go ahead and use. I guess we'll sync with Zinni again. Ooh, I did a lot of damage. All right, I'm gonna lower their special attack. Would love to use Dragon Rush, but don't really have the luxury when um their attack stat isn't fully lowered. Also, they're not they're not weak to me anymore. I'm gonna use the heal order. Maybe should have waited on that. Um. But yeah, maybe I should have waited on that. Yeah, that was pretty, it was pretty, pretty early. All right, uh, both stats are fully lowered. Both attack and uh, special are fully lowered, so we're just gonna keep on using outrage. All right, we're gonna get hit with the sink here, which isn't good, but yeah. Did they raise? No, their attack, their both attack stats are both still low. Um, I guess we can go ahead and use three heads now. I think that should be good. That did not do as much damage as I thought it would. <laughs> um, yeah, I need that sink. I, mean, I need that move gauge acceleration right now. Right, right about now would be good. Double team. Hmm. What is up with this move gauge acceleration? It's so bad. All right. So. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. 
I downed, I downed it right there, which is good. We're gonna sync with Zinnia, and then we'll see what we need to lower. Special attack. Holy, that did a lot of damage. Okay, hold up. It was a crit, and it was an AOE move. Oh, but Latios does have, oh, still fairy weakness. Oh, I got duped. Oh, I need to use three heads again. Oh, stored power? It's over, guys. It's over. Alright, well. Um. Yeah, not good. Not good at all. Unless I get, like, some lucky flinches here, which I don't think is happening. And yeah, I think the sync move is probably gonna defeat my, uh. Defeat my, um, Zinnia for sure. Oh, I got a flinch there, but it was kind of useless. Um, Hydragon might- Oh! Well, I survived it! The Hydragon still has a lot of health. Alright, let's sync move here and let's hope this crits and hope that it is enough. Alright, it's enough. Well, that was not terrible at all. Alright, I totally forgot that I had Fairy Weakness. I didn't even notice. Um, Alright, next up. Moltres. The thing about Moltres, again, is the whole sunny day, and, like, I'm afraid I'm gonna get burned. So, like, I kinda have to, like... <laughs> um, yeah. But also, like, it gains defense during the sunny day, I think. And so, usually for Champion Stadium, kinda like the be Some of the best units to use are, like, those units that basically just avoid what your opponent's doing. So, like, uh, Lily. <laughs> Lily is good, and is good. Um, I think Pikachu, one of the Pikachus might have this ability as well. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do our Lily team here with, um, with Cynthia to avoid, uh, to basically go through its, uh, its defenses. And then we'll use, um, hmm. actually we could use, uh, could use Lana because she has Fire Guard. Um, is this too overboard though? I mean, he does have, she doesn't have healing, so, and he does, so, hmm, I don't, I don't think I'm ever gonna use her, so we should just use her, um, but I don't have, I might have speed issues, I might have move gauge issues, and I know that, um, Kiawe, Kiawe, how do you, how do you pronounce his name, he definitely raises speed of my party, and I think I might need that for, um, for this. So, all right, let's do this. Um, yeah, all right. Again, I'm gonna. Uh, these moves are gonna hurt a lot. Moltres' attacks are gonna hurt a lot. So this might be a reset if I die too quickly. Um, but I should be doing a lot of damage. I should be doing a lot of damage here. Lower my defense and lower my speed. That's not what I want to see. <laughs> All right, let's do this. I think we're just gonna go straight for the um, straight for the. Uh, I wanted to sync with Zinnia, or I want. To, oh, oh my gosh, my order is terrible. I wanted to sync move with um, with e anyone besides uh, Kawhi. <laughs> All right. Well, this is kind of awkward. Uh hmm. Yeah, this is really awkward here. Yeah, I need to be sinking with Lily here. I need to be sinking with Lily. Um, because, um... Yeah, I need to be sinking with Lily here. And my Kawhi's dead. Alright. That sink move did a lot more damage on him than I thought it would. Alright, this is a... This is a... This is a quit here. <laughs> Again, Moltres is the hardest one. So... Trying to think of what I should do, cause I don't wanna, I don't wanna really focus on weather setting and stuff. But I, I guess I might not be able to escape it. Might not be able to escape the uh, setting weather. All right, let's see what options I have. 
Let's see what because I don't have that much uh, weather setting options. That's why like for me I can't really do champion stadium or I can't I'm sorry, I can't really do legendary gauntlets because I don't really have that much weather setters. Um I guess I only need three of them. But yeah, you see all these units are really bad besides like May. Um I mean, we could try for it. We could try for it. Um elegant choreography. I guess I use Winona to set rain. But then, um, she doesn't have rain, no, she doesn't have rain, uh, cause like, it's not enough to have two weather, you need to set it three times, cause during the third phase, um, they're gonna set sunny day again, and then at that point, you're kinda screwed, because <laughs> that's, that's, that's the problem with, um, Moltres, but hopefully I might have enough damage, I might be doing enough damage with Lily, uh, do we even wanna do Lily, or do we wanna do like a rock? A rock striker, maybe. Um, but the problem with using like Olivia, which is like a, a rock type striker, is that Olivia is pretty frail against physical attackers. Um, I guess I do have blue, which I never use. Might be more. Well, I guess actually, Olivia has more defense. Um. Hmm. Yeah, we want to use the big boys here. I think we definitely want to use the big boys. We want to bring out the big boys. So I might use Cynthia here. One of, one of the big heavy hitters. Heavy hitters in the support department. Um, then we also have like... Sycamore and... And in my opinion like Blue and Skyla are kind of like the better ones. Um, is the team good enough? Do we want to go with uh, a rock type striker maybe? Let's see. Um, maybe we can go with blue. Maybe we can go with blue here. Because he does have, um... He has bonjour. Bonjour, uh, raises and then lowers defense. Okay. And then we can just hit them with the hyper beam. Mm-hmm. Oh. I forgot. It's recoil. Oh wait, no, but Hyper Beam doesn't have recoil. Hmm. It doesn't have 100% accuracy though, which sucks. What can you do? Alright, we'll try with, uh, we'll try with Blue. Maybe Olivia, I think Olivia is a bit stronger, maybe a bit weaker. Yeah, we'll just try it here. Again, I'm only gonna be able to set weather like twice. So it's not gonna be that good, but we have to try. Alright, bonjour, it won't end here, and we lose rain dance there. Okay. And then we're just gonna go straight with the hyper beams. No, we're gonna use bonjour again. Because <laughs> we wanna fully raise uh, attack and special attack, I suppose. Oh, and I forgot. Tactics, I, 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 was, I was gonna mention it, but I removed um, I removed one of the units, and so my tactics are all messed up. So I need to reset those. So Cynthia first, and then Winona. All right. I guess I can fix up my sequencing here and make a Cynthia attack first. Okay. So my defense is still pretty decent. Air slash here. Lowering defense and speed. All right. Pepper beam. Maybe we can use some grateful acrobatics. We're gonna sink. See, I missed already. I hate this. <laughs> I hate moves that aren't 100% accurate. They feel so bad when you miss. Um, but yeah, we might actually have some sync move issues or sync uh, move gauge issues here. Um, so maybe Olivia would have been better with Cynthia at least, because Cynthia isn't really good at um. All right, I got a free move in. That's good. I forgot that he does that. Alright, let's hit him with an Aura Sphere, because we kind of need that. Oh! <laughs> Cynthia's weak against fire, is she? <laughs> I just noticed that. Hmm, interesting. Maybe not the best choice to use against Moltres. <laughs> As one of my heavy hitters, maybe I shouldn't use, oh, I don't know, the other blue. Um, but it's fine. I keep missing 
these uh, hyper beams, and it's so troll. It's so troll. Um, this might be a reset, guys. I don't know. This isn't looking good. Because, yeah, Cynthia's just gonna get destroyed later on. During the third phase, she's gonna get destroyed. See, if I hit the hyper beam, it does a lot of damage. I just need to hit the hyper beam. This heat wave, by the way, is gonna destroy me. Oh, I flinched! Oh, the clutch flinched right there. Awesome. And an air cutter now. All right, sweet. All right, I missed, missed another one. Was is it ninety percent accuracy, or is my or is my accuracy like just lowered for some reason? All right, that did not do any damage. <laughs> I was weak against water now. Oh my goodness. He's weak in the switching. Making me very confused. Um. I, oh, a sunny day again. See, that's it. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, it's so. Moltres is so hard because, like, you can really only get so far. Am I gonna die? No, I'm not gonna die. But you can only get so far. Oh, I'm burned, which is really bad. You can only get so far because eventually you'll just run out of ways to set the weather. Like, what are you supposed to do at this point, you know? Um, I can sink here. Yeah, I look like... it Because Moltres wasn't inputting any moves, you can predict that. Probably, um, killed Moltres there. So that should be... Is it weak to rock again? It's weak to rock again. This should be good. Um, depending on what the air slash is, I suppose. I potioned uh, Cynthia. That might not be good. Alright. Come on. Hyper Beam, don't fail me now. I need you to hit. That would be very cash money if you hit. Okay, well, double double it. Because this one has 100% accuracy, right? I don't care if I kill myself at this point. Well, I don't want to kill myself, but... Okay, it did a lot of damage. Oh, oh, recoil removal 9. Wait, I had no recoil at all? You're telling me I couldn't use double it this whole time and not taking damage? I, I have to test that off camera. Oh, okay. Well... We have done half of we have done half of the legendary gauntlet, and um, yeah, I'll uh, I guess I'll stop this video here, and then I think I'll I might just keep on going. Um, uh, that I usually don't want to take a day off, like don't want to rest because like if I rest, then I'll forget stuff. Um, because right now I kind of remembered how everything went, so I think I will I will uh, end it here. And we'll start again in the next video. So yeah, thank you for watching. And we'll finish. We'll finish. Not finish the Lane Gauntlet. But we'll at least get 12 wins for all the rewards. Is it 12 wins? Yes, 12 wins for all the rewards. No. It's only 11 wins. But I'll do 12. I'll do 12 battles. Alright, thank you for watching.